absolutely perfect conditions for day one here at Millbrook for the 2023 playing of the New Zealand Open. Players out on the course early had ideal scoring conditions and amateur from Rangiora, Kazuma Kabori took advantage. A birdie at his closing hole had him signed for a five under par 66. Young Laurie Flynn from Australia, the left-hander, had this to get to eight under at the time with a few holes to play. He would drop it for the lead at the time, but it would stumble coming home and also sign for five under par. Jared Ford from the Judgeford Golf Club, an amateur just north of Wellington. This his approach to the last. He'd make birdie there and also sign for five under par. Gun Charankal from Thailand. This is his approach to his second to last hole, the eighth on the Remarkables course, using the backboard, drawing it back for a closing birdie. He would also sign for 65. But it was Stephen Alka who everyone came to watch early on. He started with a birdie at the par 5, 10th. He turned in three under, tacked on a couple more birdies, and this would be his approach to the closing hole this morning. Alka in sensational form on the PGA Tour Champions, and he continues to strike down here at Millbrook. He signed for a 65. Leader on the Australasian PGA Tour order of merit is David Michelucci, in very good form. Come on, get it. And he would drop it from distance on the seventh hole for Michelucci to get to two under early. Later in the round, this a birdie attempt at the par 5, 15th. Another great birdie. So the Australian was on fire. A lot of low scoring here on day one.